Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Hello and welcome to Amsha Tag. Today we are going to explore the steps of creation of customized entry screen in SAP ABAP step by step. Uh, for any uh, for any records or for any uh, storage of record, uh, for either it is for any uh, report or either it is for any uh, transaction. So no matter what uh, what will be uh, the usage of this screen and you will uh, clearly understand what are the steps we have to do for making an uh, screen so let's uh, explore the steps of uh, uh, this task first of all we have the requirement gathering step in which uh, we gather the information to be stored in SAP table and the second step we will uh, ask for the each field attribute either the field uh, requ the requ required by the user have uh, some uh, numeric value or some hairy uh, character value like description or like mm, like anything else uh, or, or like any boolean uh, boolean fields like uh, x or blank uh, for the usage of any kind of uh, decision uh, we have to find all the uh, characteristics uh, and characteristic of each uh, each field or each column of the table at the third step we will uh, ask the user the arrangement of the column um, either uh, what uh, what will be the arrangement uh, of column like uh, if the user want first GL code and then company and then functional area or the user want functional area and the other things on the fourth on the fourth step we will uh, we will ask the user the number of input screen we will explore uh, this uh, later uh, because after creation of the single screen we will uh, we will explore the number of input screen uh, further at the fifth stage we have to find all the technical information of uh, uh, the requirement and we will uh, we will have to create a technical documentation for this for any uh, future change or for any uh, um, formal representation at the sixth step, we will create a technical database table in SC11. After that, uh, we will make the database table uh, ready for the input by using the table maintenance generation. This is the option uh, present in the SC11 transition. Uh, at the stage uh, 8, we will find how to change the uh, size of the column and how to change the column headings in the layout editor and the ninth step we will find and we will combine we will integrate a transition code with the entry screen we will create at the tenth step we will explore how to uh, how to enter the record into database table by using the uh, t code we will create we will create for the entry screen and last but not least after entering the records into the uh, uh, into the screen we will have to find the uh, the how many records and we will how uh, we will have to find the representation of the record by using the sc16 and uh, providing the table name so all the steps we will uh, do uh, in detail and if you want to explore all the steps to so stick to this series let's meet the next video till then bye bye take care